Hello and good Thursday evening, everybody. It is Thursday, February 23rd, 2023. Oh, wow. The year of artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence is going crazy. Yeah. But you know who's not artificial? It's Doug, actually. How you doing, Doug? The <laughs> realest of the real. Wow. I, I'm i doing great. I feel alive. How are you? Good. Notice how I didn't say that you were have an artificial intelligence. You have a real intelligence and a real body. I can see Mostly. It. Mostly. Look at you. Look at you. Oh, dear. I'm going to blush. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Rowie, how you doing? Nice to see you. Hey, Rowie. Well, how are you, Shane? I mean, that's, uh, it's been a week. How are, how are things? It's been a week. That is for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, this is a child-friendly show, Shane, Rowie says. And you're not wrong, Rowie. You're not um, wrong. It's actually not. Whenever I promote it on other <laughs> platforms, it's like, is this show for children? I'm like, hard no. Um, no. Uh, Do not let your children watch this show. Um, yeah, and for those who haven't watched the show before, welcome. Uh, this is a show, it's Doug Actually with Shane. Shane, you never see him, you only hear him. Handsome voice, handsome man, very friendly, you get very me, complimentary. You get me once a year, once a year. You gotta, and you gotta, you gotta tune in like every week for yeah. a year to get him. It's, uh, you're very elusive. It's a Christmas gift for everybody. It is, it just, once a year. I was, I was going to say something non-kid friendly. Um, and the show, we hang out, we talk about uh, life, we talk about hot topics and cold topics, we draw, we hang out with our friends and chat from all over the world to show up every week, which is amazing. Um, so yeah, welcome. Speaking of hot topics, Doug, mm, do you have any new some. clothes you want to talk about that maybe you got at Hot Topic? I have no idea what you're talking about. You don't know Hot Topic? The mm -hmm. pop culture and music inspired fashion store? No. Are they sponsoring us and I need to be wearing their clothes now? <laughs> <laughs> Hot, to Hot Topic Inc. is an American retail chain specializing in counterculture related clothing and accessories, as well as licensing music. The stores are aimed towards an audience interested in rock music and video gaming. I'd probably like it. CEO is Steve Varanas. Oh, well, I'll have to and, and, check it out. Anyway, yeah, I don't know if they have any locations here. They have uh, 675 locations as of April 2020. Wow. Hot Topic, uh, Nova Scotia. Let's see if there's anything around here. Okay. No. Yes. Uh, Hot Topic is coming to Micmac Mall. Oh. Later this year, and that was posted in 2018. Oh. Go. Well, maybe it came in oh one. Oh, my God. That is definitely possible. <laughs> so. It was a sister store. Oh, Go on. So, that was yeah, we don't need to be talking, but we don't need to I was surprised we were going anymore. this deep on the Hot Topic. <laughs> Oh, Shane's really into this. Um, so last week, if those of you who are here, I uh, was doing some retro kind of nostalgic sketches. So this is a character I originally came up with 20 years ago. I uh, had shown the original drawing once I did this version of it 20 years later. Um and then we were kind of talking about it last week on the show. So I was just like, hmm, you know, we've used Mid Journey before for like AI kind of uh, productions and kind of just seeing how to play with that and kind of use it. And I'm not amazing at it, but I'm, I'm learning how to use it better and give it prompts and things like that. And I thought, well, you know, there's a lot of controversy about AI producing art and whatnot, but I kind of look for the silver lining where I can. And I think it can be inspirational. And I think that that's what Shane and I had talked about doing was like, why don't we put in some prompts and some commands aligning with what this character's description would be and see what mid journey pops out. And, you know, maybe there's some inspiration there that I'll take and incorporate into my own character. Um, you know, you just don't know how to give it a go. So we were kind of playing around with that and thought we'd, um, 
share our results and maybe see if uh, anyone watching or in chat had some input that they thought, like, oh, you should change this or you should add this prompt and things like that. So it'll be a little collaborative, a little less actual, a little more AI to start the show, but uh, we're always doing something different. Always moving. Always, always moving, moving. yeah. Always moving. Uh, I had uh, I had fennel and carrots and celery and um, mm. uh, white beans, and I asked the AI to make me a recipe with that stuff, and I was very disappointed because it said, "Oh, here's a white bean, carrot, celery, and fennel salad," and I'm like, "Well, I could have done that." Right. Just throw it all together in a bowl. So I said, yeah. okay, make me a recipe with a, that is not a salad. And they said, okay, here's a white bean, carrot, celery, fennel soup. And I'm like, all right, forget it. You're not even trying. No. So I got angry. But you had better results. Yeah. Do we want to? Do we want to see them? Yeah. Show show uh, show everybody some results we we have. Okay, these are the results that we have from the latest so, one. Do you want this is to based describe on, what this was? Yeah, so I don't remember all the prompts because I put them in, but essentially I put in like a 15 foot tall female robot, lavender in color, uh, blades and fins on their arms and head, um, combat pose, full body. This didn't quite give me a combat pose at all. Um, then kind of like did some mentioning about being hyper realistic kind of like cinematic lighting um just trying to remember all the prompts we put in yeah and like not emotional um and in a human um droid hybrid was kind of the vibe excuse me yeah, and this is what came out of the second time. Yeah, let's, let's you show the first one. Changes. The first one looks like this. A little beefier. It felt very um, Iron Man-ish. Yeah, especially this uh, bottom two. Yeah, so that wasn't quite it. But I would love if anyone knows how that upper left one, what do you describe those legs as? What's that style of leg called? Because it's exactly what I want, like for this kind of shape. But I wasn't quite sure how oh, to describe like it. The reverse knee. Yeah, you're almost like a deer or a bird. Bird legs. <laughs> right, but I didn't think that was gonna work out great. But maybe. I think you were closer on this one for sure. Close yeah. To your... Although these legs aren't there. No, because if we put. I would put in like yeah, long they legs. Are. They kind of are. They're just not exact. Maybe I need exaggerated long legs. They need exaggerated joints because you don't Ooh. need the legs longer. You need the joints all. You need them more bendy. Triple bend. Um, what if I call it a triple bend? They're almost like spider legs, really. But yeah, okay. Let's let, let's give it a go. Uh, this is helpful stuff. Does anyone uh, in chat have any suggestions? It seems like dinosaur almost is what Roey says. Mm. Yeah, okay. Dinosaur right, jointed legs. Pump, pump, gonna, pump something out, or what do you think? I'm going to pump it. I'm going to pump it, man. Pump, pump, it, pump it up. Do we, do we want to see it, though? No. Oh, you'll wanna, you can do whatever. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, Pardon you, indeed. Watch me work. Imagine. Imagine. Can't see it uh, correctly. Hold on. Just give me one sec, Doug. I'm just gonna. Yeah. Just gonna scooch, scooch. Uh, sure. Scooch this up. Oh, the old sure. scooch and switch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The old scooch and magoo. There. There we nice. go. Nice beauty bear. Now, if people want to see it, they can see. So if you have so, any ideas on how to prompt this better, so we have add anything in. 
Right, so we have 15-foot tall, slender female robot, lavender-colored, accented fins on heads and arms, ability to morph, human and droid hybrid body, joyless temperament character, no emotion in human eyes, <laughs> full body combat pose with long legs, so long spider dinosaur legs. Yeah, put it in. Let's see what okay. Let's see what comes out. Long spider dinosaur legs. Knee reverse knee. You don't have to put that in. I'm just saying. Always a possibility. Dinosaur legs. 4K <laughs> hyper realistic <laughs> cinematic backlit lighting. Um, can I put killer? I want to put killer. Maybe that'll be a bad word, though. I, mean, yeah, I don't know if that'll go. Let's, let's... It kind of it's it kind of not in context there. Sending command. Oh, the suspense. I know it's wild. So th this is. All those visual cues are from this drawing, so they may not be right. Well, let it do its thing, and yeah, um, we can talk, and then we'll we'll pop it up when it when we get it into the into the web, into the doings, to the weeb. Oh. Now, did you want to try your your, your other one too? Ah, oh, if we can, if we have time, if people are enjoying it. Oh, I see. I see what it did. I don't, is it done? Oh. Yeah. So, pretty quick. Pretty. This is sim like this just needs to be more bendy at the bottom here and less arm spider arms. But I don't mind the spider arms if they weren't there all the time. You know, if they just kind of like up here it is needed and i don't really hate the spider legs like on the lower one if it was more like a solid leg most of the time but then you could have more um of those extra legs as needed the ant face on this one yeah it's pretty cool i don't like it on this is scary these are too scary okay you don't like them can you <laughs> Leave these open, please, because uh, I'll probably save them, or I might save them now. They're good inspiration, well, I'm gonna, though. I'm not going to mess with them. Okay. So, shall we take out the spider legs and see what happens? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, because that's not... I mean, it's it's cool, but it's not quite, quite it, is it? It's not what you're looking for. No, but it's not far off. No. Any suggestions from chat? Chuck them out there. Yeah. If you got them. How I think was your week, Doug? Did you, I think you get killer worked. Um. Oh, I don't know. What did? Oh, I did taxes. So yeah, that's fine. Oh, I gotta do that. No, thank you. Yeah. Um. Let's do. Or, Let's do, let's get rid of the spider word. And is there a specific dinosaur you were thinking of? Like a velociraptor? Because maybe dinosaur is just too, too vague. Uh, I know what he means though. Most dinosaurs had those legs, right? Those backward yeah. Well, let's give it a go and see. Any other words uh, from chat they want thrown in? The dinosaur Velociraptor facts. And yeah. I'm gonna put, put in, in put in Velociraptor because that's the that's the leg with the with the curving. You know. Yeah. How do you spell that? Uh, v e l mm -hmm. o c i r a p t o r. 
Just as it sounds. Oh, this is gonna be sexy. Did you put the Velociraptor legs? I did. Yeah. Waiting to start, friends. I like that she's um, lavender. They've been pretty consistent with the coloring. I, I think you just jinxed it, though. Oh, yeah? I mean, I guess the AI knows what lavender is. But see, you did. You jinxed it. Oh, it's gross, isn't it? No, they're all, they're all blue now. Oh, they made them a dinosaur. I... It kind of like. Oh, I lost it. No, oh, I'll get it here. All right, let's show chat what we got here. It's quite bird like. It's kind of like they. They didn't just make the dinosaur legs. These, these legs are, are almost spot on, though. Yeah, they really are. In a weird way, that's kind of the closest one. Yeah, can you move your head so we can see? Oh my goodness, yes. Sorry. <laughs> that's fine. No, I was like really into the, the the rendering, sorry. And I like that the eyes are like pronounced. So what's the hair here? Blades of metal. But it could also be weapons. Or it could till the, the farmland if you need to. So I wonder if you want to do the same thing. Like, these legs are, are basically spot on, right? Yeah, yeah. Maybe and I should then, put, like, claw hands and yeah. blades for Blade hair. hair. Blades of yeah. steel for hair. Oh, that'll be good. Oh, yeah, it'll be a hockey video game. If you do that, you gotta be, <laughs> you gotta be careful. All right, that'll be good. This is fun. Hockey, ho hockey, video game, hair. Be everyone will have a mullet. Can you, can you just do a variation on that specific one? Oh, I can. Yeah, but and, cha and change the prompt or no? If you change the prompt, you you're changing the thing. Correct. Okay. Yeah. All right, go for it. You go for it. But Imagine. this is the one that we're. This is the one that we're kind of iterating on, right? Yeah. Oh, did I save it? I'm gonna grab it again. Oh, the prompt, you mean? Yeah, I think I did. Where are you? I mean, it's in there, right? Where are you putting these prompts? What do you mean? Oh, you're just putting them in the clipboard and then trying them again. I got you. I got you. I'm with you. Yeah, yeah. You're not like pacing them into something. Just uh, mid journeys. So. What do we want to change? Claw-like hands and hair. We want to we want to make the uh, the hands hands. Uh, how many fingers? Four. There you go. And then. We want uh, blades of steel for hair. I think this is going to be something else. <laughs> <laughs> well, it definitely won't be the same. No. All right. We'll let it do its thing and in the meantime. Uh-oh. What? I'm bouncing around all over the place here. I don't know what I just turned off. Uh-oh. So it's, it's doing things. Here, i got to go back to my thing. Okay, it's looking... Early renderings are looking pretty promising. Well, we'll see how it goes. Uh, has anybody here used these... AI tools before either this or Dali or um, there's another image generation one actually there's probably a lot of them or um, 
messed around with the chat GPT stuff? Anybody in chat mucked around with those things? If so, what were your results like? <laughs> Angry Panda says, listen, I already have enough demons as it is. No need to generate more. <laughs> um, Interesting right, take on it. it. Yeah, let's see this. Here's what we got, friends. Oh, I like that okay. one. You're zoomed yeah, in pretty, me, um, pretty tight. There you go. Yeah, yeah I'm going to zoom out. Well, I haven't shown chat yet. Mm. So, so it did fix the hands, but it gave every one of them wings. You said nothing about wings, and it gave every one of them wings. Well, blades of steel for hair. Yeah, okay. But like that... that in there. And that bottom right one has the blades of steel for hair, but you're right, it does have wings, which is a bit odd. But I do like that upper, I like that one up there, yeah. So, the legs are wrong again. Back to wrong. Yeah, but I like the styling of them. They look sturdy, you know? <laughs> sturdy legs. This is, uh... Aside yeah, from that giant so... penis that's in that... Like that upper right oh, yeah, one, well, it's, got, it's got a wicked amount of junk there. It's actually just a jock strap. Still. Quite the... Well, here's one here. <laughs> just like, ha! Blades of steel. Yeah, out of this bunch, this is the best one. But I, yeah. I still think I like this one better. Oh, okay. That one's intense. Yeah, it's fun. Let's let's review them. I like that one, not for this character, but I think it's a cool thing. You know what this reminds me of is, is Transformers, because they're... Very much, yeah. Uh, Beast Wars. More than meets the eye, you know? Mm. And I don't hate elements of these, but again, it's weird that they made the head so... Like, they really gravitated to any animal or descriptor that they put in. Yeah, it's kind of like they lock on to certain words, even if you're putting it in a context. Like, you put that spider dinosaur thing in the context of legs. Yeah. But for some reason, it grabbed onto it for everything. Mm-hmm. This one's pretty close. Yeah. To your drawing. And, and these are these are like early renderings. The brother, yeah, yeah. the brother. Hmm. Iron Man, very Iron Manny. Yeah, sure. initially. So I mean, that's cool. So do you want to do the other one now? Roey says he has used these, uh, but he has only he's only generated stuff in incognito mode. What's that mean? It means that he doesn't want to be known to have created. I'm oh, sorry. okay. I thought he was doing like inappropriate things. I'm like, oh, I didn't know you could. That's fun. Uh, which one reminds you of creatures in a quiet place? I haven't seen a quiet place because I don't watch horror movies because uh, they make me scared. Well, I'm guessing that bottom left. This one. It scares me. I'm excited. I'm excited to see what how close we can get with this one. All right. Do you want to zoom in a little bit on that one? Ooh, sure do. Bloop, bloop. I'll have to zoom me as I can get. Do you want to tell us a little bit about what's going on there? Yeah. Similar to the previous one, this character um, was also from around the same time, 20 years ago. And the original one's proportions were a little more exaggerated, but also made it feel a little bit unrealistic, too. So... I kind of made it a bit more human based, I guess, but still has like some barbaric kind of vibes going on. And uh, so the pose from this one and the original uh, are very much aligned. Body proportions are a little different. However, this hand wasn't really doing anything. It was almost like, come here. And, uh, so then we were kind of doing the show last week and then we we're asking chat what we should um, put in the hand and some people said a balloon and a balloon made sense and then afterwards 
I, I didn't like it at first, but then afterwards I was like, oh, it would have been fun to have the hanging head and the balloon. And then... Or the balloon of a head or something. I don't know. I hadn't... I just wasn't... Uh, I didn't... The, the balloon, I liked the humor element of it, but I didn't quite know how to execute it in that moment. So... Yeah, you, you didn't like it, and it was clear. I'm just going to throw that out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, yeah, I was... <laughs> I was almost offended. You're like, a balloon. Come on! <laughs> it just seems so obvious. Oh my goodness, Bia, coming in with a raid of seven people. Hi. Oh, oh hi, Bia. Dog. Guten Abend. Yes, hello. Welcome, our German friends. And the non-German people that were in Bia's channel. Yeah, those, welcome, welcome. Those people as well. I don't want to be, uh, you know, exclusionary. You're not. You're very inclusive. Welcome. Yeah. This is Doug, the one in the studio. Hey. He he is not artificial. No, but we're talking about artificial tonight. Um, to piggyback off last week, we we're just talking about this. Bia, you might remember this drawing based off the original drawing for 20 years ago. What we've been doing tonight is for inspiration using mid journey and prompts to try to recreate these drawings in mid journey to kind of see what would come out. And you never know, there could be some really cool like inspiration that comes of it. Maybe some color schemes, maybe some materials for the characters, for their clothing and that kind of stuff. So as I preambled it earlier, there's a lot of, you know, controversy about AI, but I think there is some use for it in terms of inspiration. I think if you say, Oh, I created this with AI and it's mine, that might be, you know, something that's a topic hot topic because we talked about hot topics hot earlier topic. but uh i think if you use it as a, a tool of inspiration for your own art i think it's uh it's got great value great value great value um i agree the one thing about that too is like isn't there a certain amount of if you if you change it a certain amount then it becomes yours like there's this idea of fair use right true uh i i guess what i'm saying when it's not yours is my understanding of how it works is people could put in um, such and such art style. Um, right, right. The other thing the, is, is if you don't change it at all, it's clearly not yours because just coming up with a prompt doesn't does not make an artist. Because I could come up with a prompt, and I am no artist. Well, we'll do that next after we do this. Uh, Shane's going to come up with a character, his own intergalactic hussy. Oh man, how exciting. It's pretty exciting. How exciting. Nakfa, hello. Nice Hi. Thanks for chatting, welcome. All right, Hi, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get to this. I'm gonna start, uh, Shane will flirt with everyone. I oh am, yeah, absolutely. How are you doing? I, I am gonna start doing some hey. junk here. I'm in the way though, so whatever. That's fine. Everybody likes to see Doug super up close. And look, here we go. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, so has anybody who has just come in ever played with the AI art stuff? And if so, what are your thoughts on it? Do you have any ones that turned out absolutely amazing that you want to share? We do have an art room in our Discord, exclamation point Discord. It may or may not work. We'll, uh, you know, give it a go. See how it goes. How was your stream, Bia? What were you streaming about? You working on some photos? Are you doing some art? So flirty. I had fennel salad for dinner, so... How's that for flirty? Pretty flirty. You're pretty, pretty, pretty good. Pretty good? Pretty good. So I did end up making, so I asked chat GPT to make me a uh, recipe with some ingredients I had, and it basically told me to throw them all in a bowl and make a salad. So that's what I did. Mm-hmm. You're not boring, Bia. How can you be boring? I love going to your streams. I don't understand what you're saying, but I like going there. <laughs> I 
I only understand maybe an eighth of the German I hear. What about a horror balloon? Angry Panda says. Doesn't that clown have a red balloon at some point? Oh yeah, that's true. The Pennywise is the is the clown's name. Mm -hmm. And it's it. And I will never watch it. And there was a new one recently, and everyone's like, "You should see it." And I'm like, "I am. You can forget about it. No, thank you. Not a fan of the horror. Can't do it. No. Not my jam." You're not a big horror fan, Doug? Oh, balls. Uh, no. Balls? I put a comma outside of my box. <laughs> <laughs> As you do from time to time. You can't, can't get them all in the box, you know? Mm -hmm. It's not that easy. Not that simple. So no one else has touched on the old uh, AI art? I was also thinking about asking uh, ChatGPT to to write me a song because it does that fairly well. Some lyrics. What do you call? Uh, oh, I'll call it a bustier. How do you spell that? Bustier. Yeah. Uh, let me spell it wrong first. And <laughs> thank you. <laughs> uh, it's it's B U S T I E R, just as you would expect it to be. Bustier. Okay. Is it? Can you? Can you? Yeah, I guess it's a bustier. Would you? Is it leather, Doug? Is it a leather bustier? No, it's armored. Armored. Did you put armored? I did. Yeah. So we're gonna see if it's gonna like some of these words. I'm gonna like. Uh, I'm gonna copy this so we have it. Showing them what's going on. This one does. Oh, I can't. We're fighting over the. Over I have some banned words. I can't say bear. Bear is banned. Okay. I'm learning a lot here. I'm learning a lot. They can't bear with it. You could spell bear, but you could spell it wrong. But then right. they would lock onto that and it would be a bear. Yeah. So what's another word for like expose? Can I say exposed arms? Yeah, try that. Hands and I can't say combat. And uh, I'll say exposed legs. I don't know if exposed is gonna be good either. If that doesn't work, then you're going to have to start describing the length of the clothing, <laughs> like like to the to the bicep. Yeah, it uh, seems boost. to like it so far. Oh fuck! I didn't. I forgot some things I needed. Anyway, we'll see what happens. What'd you forget? Uh, the quality of the image I wanted, and that I wanted full body. Okay, Bia, you have a great walk. Take care, Bia. When you get back. Oh. <laughs> That's, I mean. Yeah. No, I, I know. Oh. Closer than I, than I. Huh. Wow, that's pretty good. Here, let's open it in the browser. Oh, it's not done. Oh. Yeah, it's done. Because it's it's easier to see in here. Yeah, that's great inspiration. I mean, this is pretty close to spot on in in a sense. Like this is really close. And I'm loving that one. bottom right one with the knives. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is cool. I wonder if you did variations on 
Can do. This one and this one. If they would... Now, do they change the perspective? Will they give you more of a full body or no? Let's see. Let's see. That's so, cool. that's, variations that's, that's... of one uh, and two. variations of... Okay, I'm going to go back. Uh, variations of two and four, right? Yeah, two and four. Bia likes the the left bottom one. Oh, that's the one we didn't do. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Man, you can't win them all, Bia. So that was one. Where? This is the number one one here. Okay, let me put this up. In the... Oh, she looks real mean there in the uh, top left one yeah these are great yeah these are this is this is cool this is pretty cool whatever all description right. you use here is good good start all right so let's go back and see what the other ones were oh yeah 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 So this is two. Mm -hmm. The bottom right one, or yeah, it kind of has like floaty horns, which is kind of fun because maybe she could just send them to go do some work that she's too lazy to go over and do. Oh, kind of like the guy in um, Guardians of the Galaxy with his whistle. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I like the original better than these ones, though. Okay. And then let's go back. And then that one. Yeah. I think that was that was the one I liked a lot. Oh yeah, these are pretty cool. Even the background's cool. Yeah, so let's let me put in like the other prompts I felt I missed and see what pops up. Yeah, those are, these are good. See, and but here's the thing is like this is so hold on one sec dog yeah sure sure this uh this is the originals right yes yeah and i think that um i think that this is better than any of these well, i would have well yeah i don't like the bottom two so much but um i just don't like the shoulder pads on the bottom too they're kind of weird yeah and then the ones coming out but maybe those are helmets on her shoulder actually now that i think about it that thing on her left shoulder might be a helmet so then i think this is this one these are better than than the original mm -hmm. and then the top right one I think I think I like this one best I agree okay cool all right so let's try it again with what I think I wanted to say imagine looks like someone from arcane is that a show or something Yes, an animated series on on the Netflix even. Oh yeah, I've seen ads for this. Oh, it's a League of Legends thing. <laughs> you you play a lot of League of Legends, eh, Roy? It's an awesome animated series? Okay, cool. Maybe I'll check it out. I haven't watched an animated series in a long time. Alright, I'm ready. Boom. I love the... Um, they've got this... Uh, what's it called? 
lineup of all the characters for the show. Oh yeah. Oh, like they're like walking in slow motion kind of thing. No, they're like uh, here. Standing side by side. Standing side by side in the wonderful world. Giving off vibes of a beautiful girl. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they're in an actual lineup. That's fun. I think I have seen an episode of this. Um, let's go back to Discord. Uh-oh, I lost it. And you'll never get it back. It is hard to find sometimes. Oh, wow. That's cool. Should we show the, show the peoples? Yeah, yeah. That bottom right one's badass, man. Yeah, it really is. Actually, so is this top. Yeah, I like that one too, yeah. I like them all, actually. The bottom left one's a little proportiony odd, but whatever. No one said she was from any place we've ever been. Well, she's intergalactic, right? Exactly. Intergalactic! <laughs> I don't need to yell. <laughs> Just, yeah. Great. She's just in a in a fight with a bloody ear. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's uh, the face paint's cool too. Definitely. See, I could see how you could use this for, for inspiration. Totally. Yeah, yeah. You're even just like the lighting. You know, you're just like, oh yeah, maybe that's where the highlight should be. Right. I wasn't quite thinking of that light source being there or that color of light being used as opposed to just like sunlight. Like, there's some elements of that that are cool. Yeah, I think this is the weakest one of the bunch, though. I Agreed. Think, uh, yeah. I think that, this is the strongest one. I'm drawn to that one the most. Yeah, that's cool. But I like that one a lot, too. Yeah, I think these two are the... I, I like these two the best. What? what you know what? The you know what, though? It's, it's, it's my movie. So I will say... She's going to have a wardrobe change. This is very similar to your drawing. Like, even the face paint makes up the bits of the helmet that aren't there. Yeah. And then these bits. Yeah. Yeah, this is super cool. All right. So... Do you want me to type what you think about what you want your character to be? Or do you want me to pr oh, ask you a... questions and then uh, you can answer and then that'll I'll put those prompts in? Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah, you're going to need to prompt me because I don't have a character popped into my head, you know? Okay, so, uh, and chat, feel free to help Shane out here. Absolutely. Chuck in your uh, answers to these questions as well and we'll just kind of like mishmash together ourselves a character so is your character female or male or not a gender um let's go with the let's go male because you've been doing females all evening okay um is are they humanoid or are they alien are they uh mixed between robot human what are you feeling i would like them to be large <laughs> so i know that doesn't answer your question okay um, large in a, in a tall way a uh, rowie wants a, a george clooney like face okay okay um Can he be floating on, can he be like surfing on a floating 
surfboard or skateboard or or like hoverboard hoverboard can you be on a hoverboard sure is there a uh, golden, golden skin yeah um what's the hair like is he wearing a helmet for safety is he like is he in this intergalactic hussy realm? Like, is he futuristic? Is, what's the deal? Sure, he's wearing a helmet, but it's not for safety. <laughs> um, so we'll say fashion helmet? Yeah, he's wearing a fashion helmet. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's his disposition? Jolly. They're gonna make them. They're gonna make them fat. Yeah. Um, oh, well, I could say f fit instead of large. Do yeah, you want yeah. them fit? Big, big, fit, tall. Yeah. Um. Don't what? Want too much like me, you know. The what? Funny face, the golden skin. Yeah. What? Uh, what's he up to? Like, is he carrying anything? Does he have a weapon? Oh, people are making copies of my art. Other people are like making copies of the prompts I put in. Um, oh, yeah. Anyway, look at this person's version of your thing. I don't think that's no. That one's an anime girl. Um, <laughs> it's the horns and the thing—they're the same. <laughs> no? I don't know. Um, Okay, let's go back to... That one above it, though, is definitely. This is all the same person, right? Oh, you're right. I'm so sorry. My bad. Anyway, back to your character. Um, uh, like, are they swinging a golf club? Are they carrying a, an animal? Like, what are they doing? Uh, are they... Did you put them on the uh, hoverboard? Absolutely. That's what they're doing. They're on a hoverboard. Okay. Um, okay, so... It'll be interesting to see because we didn't describe any clothing for him. Yeah, we'll see what comes up. Yeah. We'll see what they put him in. Oh, yeah. Except for the fashion helmet. Well, He's definitely wearing a fashion helmet. I think they always make them wear clothes. It's pretty... Pretty, uh... I would assume so. I, I just wonder what. Oh, oh you're, you're going to get a, a golden George Clooney up in that upper uh, upper right. <laughs> <laughs> the anticipation. Oh, well, looks, that's pretty good. That bottom one looks weird, though, because he's, like, cut off at the waist. It's like he just... <laughs> his oh, just... His, done his, his head's a cover cover <laughs> So good. I don't know where the George Clooney is there, or and there's kind of it. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. George Clooney car. And then again, uh, it's just like he's legless. And this is a toy. It looks like a toy. It, it's it is, is this a toy. They, they've made a toy. You could 3D print that for sure. So which one's your favorite? Or what, Why what... is he so old? Oh, maybe we need to put a young George Clooney. Oh. No one had golden and skin, though, did they? No, they made the hoverboard his skin and it gold. Also, all these hoverboards are on the ground. I don't know. Yeah, if they're, they're not hovering. Are. Yeah. None of them are hovering. Okay, so let's let's, re let's uh, rework this a little bit. Okay, let's leave the George Clooney one up, uh, uh, this one up, while we rework this because this is amazing. <laughs> Like, I want that as like a trinket. If somebody could three D print that and send it to me, I'd love that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's 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 do this again. 
I gotta tell you, this guy does have a fashion helmet. Right. That is, if that, that's a fashion helmet. If I ever. So, male, big, fit, tall. Like that didn't really f work, did it? George, young, George Clooney. This <clears throat> this weird head hoverboard cloning thing is amazing. <laughs> um, what's a descriptor for a fashion helmet? Like, hmm. What types of fashion are there? Fabulous. That's right. That's what we want. A fabulous fashion helmet. That's exactly what we want. I, a jolly character. I didn't really see a lot of jolly in any of those characters. Right. So maybe remove the word jolly and put in place. Um, yeah, because these none of these are. I mean, they're stoic, if anything. So do you want stoic and see what if we get jolly? No, maybe we'd just uh, put in um, uh, a different word for hat, but just put in hat. Let's put a smile on these guys' faces. Yeah, like I mean, you're you're hoverboarding around. You're George Clooney. Uh, can you do full body? Can you put full body in there? Oh somewhere? yeah, I want that. You're right, full body. Full body. Show me your beautiful body. Full body. Boom! Alright, let's see how this turns out. Can't be any worse. But we did laugh a lot. Oh, we got all full bodies to start. That's nice. So you're going to call this guy like the Golden Surfer? No, that's too close to the Silver Surfer. Uh, you might be right. Is it done? I don't know. Let me just... One sec. Okay. I think we got a good one. I'm liking that bottom left. But why are none of the boards hovering? They're all just skateboards. Maybe we need to say flying board. You like the bottom left guy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like the bottom right guy. I think the bottom right guy looks the coolest. Although it is just, um, what's that band? <laughs> Oh, uh, Daft Punk. Daft Punk. Yeah. yeah. Well, that upper left one, though, like, I really like his board. It's kind of like a little, like, it's it's like one of those little vacuums, like a Roomba. Yeah, this is a, a old guy trying to be cool riding on a vacuum. Yep, that's exactly it. It's got weird arms. Arm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> This is the closest to what I had in my head. <laughs> <laughs> I like his shoes. Yeah, I'd wear those. He's... The <laughs> outfit they put him in is amazing. Well, that's fabulous fashion. That is fabulous fashion. <laughs> that one is actually pretty cool. Yeah, very futuristic, very daft punky. 
and then this is the one that you like. Yeah, because that's what he looks like when he's not Daft Punked out. Still old. And I wrote young. Like, this guy's old? This yeah. guy's old. No, Who I knows? don't. Who knows? Yeah. And this guy's... Eh, eh, uh, like 38. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, you it's like you've almost seen someone wear that before somewhere. Like it's pretty yeah, bizarre. I mean, this is, this is this Tony's just going out for a skate, you know? Yeah. yeah. In the, in the year in the year 2050. Yeah. Do you want to give it one more go? Cuz you really one you more? haven't got the floating board yet. And I think that's cool. I want the floating board yeah, and then okay. and then I think uh, then I think we're good. Okay. I'm gonna zoom this. Uh, let me just zoom this out so that sure. uh, everybody can have a look at all four of these. Uh, Beauty. Before we move on. All right. Oh, this is fun. Um, I, I I do think that Mid Journey is probably the best of these AI image generators. It fe it feels like. Um, like they always seem to do a really, I guess, I don't know. I, cause I was using Dali the other day and I've never used it. How was it? I mean, maybe my prompts are just not that great, but it doesn't seem as good as this. This feels more like art where Dali feels more like image. Does that make sense? Okay, yeah. This feels like it's coming from a place of artistic. Top right looks like a budget older Chris North. <laughs> it looks like um, Back to the Future Biff helmet, too. So you, you do play a lot of League of Legends, Roy. Uh, are you good at it? Are you ranked? Do you play ranked? I don't play the game. But I know people who do. Because there's a lot of people that do. Very popular. Do you have a crew? Do you play with a crew? You play rank, but you don't try. Well, that's good as long as you have fun. That's the main thing. Having fun. Oh, no. That baby what? one's not good. No. Oh yeah! Now we're uh, talking. We we got some. Ho ho ho, ho ho! We're getting good. <laughs> we're getting good. <laughs> Just wait. Just wait, chat. Just wait till you see this. Now we're cooking with olive oil. Should be down at the bottom. Yeah. Hot damn! Oh no! What? Uh, I have to reconnect to you. I've lost connection. Oh. You got it? Dun, dun, dun. I'll be right back. No problem. I'll be right back. We're using anticipation as a weapon. These are good. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. These are really good. <laughs> I don't know which oh, one I love man. the most, but I mean, these are amazing. Like top left is there pretty something. I'm loving top, top left. Top right, it, top right is pretty darn good too. But and it, it's it's actually hovering. What is this at the bottom? I love him. He's just like he's this, he's. Yeah, that's pretty good too. 
Did you say chariot at all? No. Nope. <laughs> Not even. <laughs> but these guys are bomb. Rodrigo, he says, I can't explain how much I don't like these. Um, the guy in the upper right has two fingers and a thumb. And the guy who has, like, the chariots of fire, I don't know what his left hand is reaching for. Man, that's, that pose is amazing, though. <laughs> the guy on the on the right is definitely going... Or the guy on the top left is definitely going into a turn. The yeah. guy on the bottom right is definitely jumping. And for some reason, I feel like it's an ad for a pizza place. Or cigarettes. Cigarettes. Could be cigarettes. I do like his hat. Let's zoom in on these. Let's get a, let's get a closer look on these guys. Uh, unfortunately, they're just a the low-end rendering. But, uh, yeah, I, don't, is that his, I think that's his hair. Yeah, that's his hair. He's not wearing a fashion uh, helmet too much. And his, uh, is, his abs are weird. But I like his, um, I like his little wristbands. I also do like his weird finger hand. Oh, well, that's cool. Maybe that's his jam. I mean, he is intergalactic. He doesn't have to have as many fingers as you and I. This guy's the best. He's so happy. He's moving. Yeah. He's gone so fast. And he's got these amazing goggles that he's not wearing right now. Yeah. But this guy, I mean, he's just classic. He's, He's like, a little bit all over the place in his face. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. But I don't think I wrote handsome anywhere, to be fair. George Clooney. That's handsome. Yeah. I guess that's subjective. He's also turning his own hand over. So, do you want to draw any of these? Oh, I suppose I could. I do. <laughs> I do want to draw them. <laughs> Which one do you want to draw? You choose. You and chat choose. That's a good game. I like that game. I think. Okay, I'll let chat choose, but I'm gonna leave up my choice right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want that one? Okay. I think so, right? It's either him or this. Nah. This guy's pretty good because he's happy. This guy's pretty good, too. I don't know, man. They're all great. Bottom right from Rowie. Okay. That guy. Bottom left from me. Any other votes out there? Doug will be the uh, final vote, the, t the tiebreaker. That's fine. Oh, okay. That's all we have. Um, can you show me the other one again? He's so happy, <laughs> this guy. Um, I also do think that this one's pretty freaking great. That's that's These like got the best pose. Are amazing. Best pose. Well, second best pose. This is the yeah. Best pose. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm I like not gonna choose. Board too? Oh man, yeah. all of these are great. <laughs> this is a which little one? weird, though. Um, which one? Which one? Uh, get someone from chat to pick the tiebreaker. <clears throat> I mean, little Anna said that one seems fun, but I don't know which one I was on when she said it. Oh, you're gonna have to be a little bit more specific. Can we guess their net worth? Absolutely, Roe. Guess it away. <laughs> I feel that guy is wearing his net worth. It's a bunch of bears dancing. Didn't even say anything. <laughs> <laughs> keeps getting weirder and weirder <laughs> that's a good show i'm having a great i'm having a hell of a time all right so now we got now we've got three different ones little Ange says this one i say this one 
bro he says this one well let's do all three all right so this guy gets left in the cold yeah the only one wearing a really true fashion helmet and a wonderful mustache i must say yeah um yeah if you could just leave those up for me somehow uh yeah absolutely i'm gonna move them out of the way uh so you can also see chat again uh no it won't uh it it's better if i see the art you're gonna have to just talk through everything for me okay yeah no problem sorry chat chat go to hell yeah how's that looking for you beauty thank you Oh, post. Okay, so Little Ange says, um, just ask Chat GPT to write a sweet poem about me, Angry Panda, Nacho, and Mantra. Love the poem. Put the poem in the in the chat or in the Discord. I want to read it too. And if you're in Chat GPT, maybe you could get Chat GPT to generate a mid-journey prompt for us. Yeah, that's cool. Get the AIs talking to each other. Yeah. Break the internet. Got a weird little club fist going on this guy. He's yeah, they all have socks on. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of his leggings is falling down. He's going so fast. Oh, yeah. Posted Jen. an art since poem is art? Absolutely, poem is art. Let's go. Oh, I don't know. Tell, ask Ch chat G GPT to make a mid-journey prompt to draw a character of your choice. Either your choice or chat GPT's choice. And then, and then once it generates one that we think is good, we'll, pu we'll plug it in and see what comes out. Yeah, that'd be AI, cool. AI making making AI art. I mean, is it aware of what Mid Journey is? Oh, I would imagine. You could also ask it to write a very good prompt for an art AI and see if it just does it on its own. Oh, <laughs> I just realized this guy only has one sleeve holding his shirt up. Yeah, he's, he's, he's got, <laughs> it's, it's uh, a halflet. It's not a singlet. It's a halflet. No, it's, uh, it's, it's amazing. It actually this just is... covers his right side. <laughs> definitely, and, and the right side of his neck this is definitely fashion forward. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. And fa fabulous fashion. I love that the leggings aren't even either. He's got a, one knee pad and one full leg sparkly. Yeah. This is going to blow, like, this could blow fashion. Up. Yeah. Oh my God, yeah. Like, like, I could go to fashion school now, tomorrow, and just do stuff. That this is my final project <laughs> like uh it's fashion helmet season like what the hell what did you uh, know about this? get get on board yeah i made some junk have you not been to fashion helmet season yeah clearly not all right 
What do you All right, need to so do? You're going to have to just describe what you're doing. I just need to go get a drink. Oh, yeah. I will, I will be right back. I'm drawing that guy. Um, <laughs> that's what I'm doing. Um, yeah, I'm just doing like uh, some early um, placement lines so I can kind of get an understanding of proportions a bit better because the proportions are a bit wonky, but I kind of like that because it makes me feel like I can have some fun and freedom and not be too self-conscious of what I'm actually doing. Is there much going on this weekend with everyone's lives? How's it going now, Doug? Oh, great. Now that you're back. I think I was rather boring when you were gone. Um, absolutely not. You're you're doing a, a drawing, and that's exciting. Yeah. You want me? So I was talking to a, a friend of mine, and I was trying to describe the show. Oh, yeah? She's like, and, and then later she said, oh, you mean the show where you narrate his drawings and I'm like that's not exactly what I do but we sure. can give it a go you have some... we can give it a go yeah do it okay I'm gonna do it like um, like it's a golf game okay I'll be quiet this is gonna be, is gonna be hushed hushed tones can I do some let me see Doug let me see Doug going in for the sparkles he's, he's now taking a, a stab at the gold lame of the left leg of our hero, Jimbo Jones. Jimbo Jones is amazing. Jimbo Jones is a self-chosen name. That was not his given name, as you can plainly see by his sandals. Mm -hmm. Doug putting in some fine detail work. Now on the right leg of our hero. Jimbo loves Jumbo. Jimbo loves jambalaya and halflets. <laughs> that's a sing that's a singlet, but half of it. Mm -hmm. He likes to wear them on his right shoulder and right mm -hmm. shoulder only. And I know why, because you can see here he was bitten by a shark. And I imagine he just wears it for vanity reasons and covers up some scars. Oh, it's a scar cover upper. But still likes to be a little risque and show a bit of flesh. Mr. Rowe says, loving the Homer Simpson, Simpson lips you're making there, Doug. <laughs> That's a mustache, but yes. I'll it's a that. mustache and a beard, but yeah, for the for the short term. Yeah. It's an older tan France. <laughs> That's what it says. It's an older tan France with a beard. Some futuristic fashion on a hoverboard. That's pretty darn close to you. That's pretty much what Shane put in. You're right. <laughs> Only George Clooney's in here somewhere. 
in its uh, fabulous fashion. Helmet. Ha helmet. Fabulous fashion helmet. And hoverboard was definitely in there. Yeah. But we had to, like, describe that it wasn't on the ground because it kept putting it on the ground. Adds, uh, so chat GPT is not really describing the character well. It adds more stort than character description. Oh, okay. What's, what's stort? You just need to figure out how to ask it better. <laughs> Speak better. Oh, no, she said that. <laughs> not me. <laughs> oh, more story. Oh, not, not stort. Okay. <laughs> That makes sense. Well, and that's sort of what it does, right? Chat GPT. Yeah, you you want a descriptive image generation prompt, maybe. I don't know. I don't know how you would do that. Uh, what was the prompt? Let me find the prompt for you. Yeah, there you go. go. Oh, you mean like literally looks like a game. Here was the prompt though, either way. Yes, this would be this would be a, a, a decent game like you guys give us a prompt. We plug it into, uh, what's it called? Mid Journey. And then Doug draws that. We pick one of the four and Doug draws it. That's cool. I like that. That's, That's a good basically game. what we did today. Yeah. <laughs> we just came up with a new game. Oh my God. Like, we're going to be huge. It's a great way. See, this is, this is what you need to do with this new AI craze is find ways to use it where uh, it makes sense for you. Mm hmm. And for us, it's making amazing characters look this badass. I love his hair. Like it's so luxe. It is pretty amazing. Uh -oh. oh, or try and guess the prompt out of the. Like, Doug draws something, and then we try and guess what the prompt would be. I mean, that's what we were doing at the beginning with Doug's. Uh, characters was taking that character and being like, okay, what would be the prompt here? And then seeing how close the characters uh, it spat out was, which was pretty close, I gotta say. Mm. It took a like couple iterations, but we got we got there on some of them. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I like this idea of using AI prompts and seeing what comes out. <clears throat> I'm just gonna put Bia's in there. Yeah, see what happens. It's, uh, I might add a couple of things. Just, you can still see this, right, Doug? The man? Jumbo Jones? Uh, yeah, I can see what I need to see, actually, because I'm just, ooh. Shit oh, went crazy. What have I done? What have I done? I, I think we're back to normal. For whatever that means. That's perfect. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Uh, I shouldn't be too long. No, oh, you do whatever. What do you have on the go this weekend? Oh. Slash imagine. Slash imagine, and then see the thing that's about yet, yeah, and then type your junk in there. Now put in like 4K, um, full body, uh, hyper realistic, cinematic lighting. And that's kind of the look and feel we've been using so far tonight, just to keep in the same vein if you want. Missing required words. Oh, you need the word character in there. Oh, how do I? It just uh, says resubmit, but copy it. it. Has to edit it. Oh, well, just copy it and paste it again. Or did you have it somewhere? Just because you're in the character chat, um, you need to have the word oh, character yeah, the word in there. Did... So at the bottom. That, ah, from, yeah. yeah, yeah, okay, thank you. 
Yep. Blue shiny fur, blue piercing eyes, and perky ears. They would wear a blue and white bodysuit and emblem on the chest, specializing boots for gripping and a fluttering blue cape. Their impressive strength and agility. They inspire us to be our own heroes. I'm using this. I'm putting this in mid journey and seeing what happens. <clears throat> it's interesting reading some of the prompts of the other people. Mm-hmm. This person put in two females, red hair queen, dark hair queen, romantic, cinematic lighting, full HD, moody lighting, castle fantasy, and they're kissing. They wrote kissing. They oh, wrote the word they kiss. Did. Okay, sorry. I thought, I thought the thing was just like, okay, we'll just make them all smooch. <laughs> if you don't say don't smooch, we're going to make it smooch. That's right. Where's mine? Uh, scroll down. There you go. There it is. Uh, no, that's by Roberta Rita. Nope. Keep going down. No, that's it. That's as down as I can go. Oh, maybe go up. Hmm. Did it work? Because uh, those are your things that it wouldn't let you do it, so it's definitely below those. It here it is here. Okay. Anything. Oh. Male character. Okay. Take out the imagine. Yeah. And just take that empty space out. Now try it. Thing is, you need the imagine. So copy all that. And then try it. But you need the prompt. So try the slash imagine and then put it in the prompt. Oh, okay. I am not good at this. Guy. Imagine. Yeah. And then just grab that. Pro yeah. And then fire it all in there. Perfect. We're working on it, and then and then I'll I'll do uh, little Andrews. Okay. How's your skateboard fellow going? I think he's good. It's, I'm just doing sketches. I'm not doing like super crazy shit. You want the next guy? Yeah, that'd be awesome. Oh, your guy. I want to see this. Uh, what happens? Oh wow. These are awesome. He fits right in with all this. <laughs> so He's good. Very fashiony. Uh, I like his, his nose. Glasses. It has a nose covering on his glasses. I like on that. this one too. Yeah. This is I'll... this fashion's cool. I like this jacket. Yeah. I'd wear that outfit. Should grow my hair back. A science guy for sure. Well, he looks that way, but he's murderous. Oh, he's got a mess up. Science it's like he's taking his shoe off though on his right leg because it's like it doesn't make sense. He's just about leave. He's just about to leave. <laughs> I got a I got a conference to go to. So that's yours, Bia. That's your older tan France with a, a beard, some futuristic 
fashion on a hoverboard. And then we just added some cinematic lighting. He's got tattoos and everything. So does the guy tattoos. below him. Oh, yeah. On his hand. Yeah. I like this guy the best. Yeah. Yeah. Or that guy. He's pretty joyous. It's true. All right. Now let me get you back to where you need to be. I want to see little Angels too, though. Let me leave it on this, and you tell me when I can go back to the thing, and I'll put little anges in. No, you go for it. I'm uh, just really working on this thigh. Oh, sweet. <laughs> 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 oh, I gotta... Look how good you are at it now, though. Oh, someone did one of uh, Bia's. Go up, go up. It looks really good. Someone did one of Bia's. Yeah, they did it again. Right there. Office Fuji. So they used her prompt, the prompt you put in and made another one. His legs are a little funky, but... Yeah, that's I like the bottom Neo-y guy. Yeah, they took out the hyper-realistic this... and... Uh stuff but yeah this, this guy is also a hoverboard mm -hmm. the guy on the top right but that guy in the lower left he's got like got <laughs> cool fashion yeah this feels like this could be in a sci-fi movie and this is just one of the guys on the street yeah who happens to be your father Papa? Mm-hmm. That's like Al Pacino is on the hoverboard. It, it, the proportions are so wacky. He's got the <laughs> tiniest legs. <laughs> uh, All right. Good. Back to Beardy LaRue. Papa? Is that you, Papa? What's up, We'll Ron? keep you posted and see if anybody else... Uh, I, oh, I don't know. Probably a million things. But I uh, I'm Alf. I'm thinking Alf. Oh, maybe. So I have to put the word character, right? In that particular chat, you do, yeah. And I want uh, 4K, right? Okay. Yeah, why not? If you can have it. Cinematic lighting. Herky is banned. Okay. Really? Uh, what's another word for perky ears? Pointy. Mm. What about standy uppy? Erect. I think that'll be banned. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> if perky is banned, erect is absolutely banned. <laughs> It's neat that people take your prompts and then try them again with some other stuff. Mm -hmm. Do you need this stuff? I do, yeah. Thanks. Oh. Oh, man. These are good. 
It's making good stuff. Oh, wow. Holy shit. That's like uh, Thundercats. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. That's that's pretty amazing, actually. Why does he have Why? three uh, legs? He's got, he's got so many legs. <laughs> <laughs> Look how many legs he has. <laughs> So th this one's cool, and I like the ones with the with the correct amount of legs. Well, he doesn't there either. He's got three as well. This guy, yeah, yeah. So I like this one, and I like this one. <laughs> well, if you want to go grab a high res version of the one you like, and you can print it off and send it to Valange, or not print it off, but just send her the. Um, Digital copy. Which one do you like, Little Ange? Out of these. Too many legs here. I think they all have too many legs, actually, if you kind of take a deeper look. Uh, this guy's just got a hole in one of his legs. This guy <laughs> has the right amount of legs. Okay. These two have five legs. <laughs> yeah. And super shorts. That's amazing. Oh, little Ange says, by the way, we finally have the nacho art piece. Oh, nice. Delivered. Beauty. My 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 work here is done. <laughs> you're like that uh, prompt I put in earlier when you're like the female. <laughs> you finally delivered. Finally delivered. It only took me two months. <laughs> Almost to the day. <laughs> oh really? This <laughs> is a little, little bit of trouble there. Ah, you're all right. You can't have enough legs. That's true. Oh, I got him a little bit smushed. Wasn't giving you the full Monte. The full Monte. I love this idea of like, it's a modern chariot and all it is is this weird automatic surfboard. Right. Last time you tried it, Mid Journey wasn't doing good in koalas. <laughs> like it didn't do koalas very well. <laughs> and it's computer vision was good, but doesn't know what a koala is. Can't place uh. it. You got anything on the go this weekend, Doug? What do you got on the go? Um, a little bit, I guess. Um, going out on Saturday, um, then curling on Sunday, and then that's about it. Yeah, you. Oh, right on. How's curling going? Are you um, liking the game? Yeah, it's 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 um it's good. I don't know that I'll become a curler Olympic per se, curler? Oh, man. or even like a recreational one. I don't know. Yeah, but it's nice to know how to do stuff, you know. So I know how to. I know the principles of curling, but am I a curler? I don't know that I'm built for it. Uh, what's a curler's build? Well, apparently anything. Um, it's just all about being able to slide 
mm-hmm. on one leg without That's using right. your hands. Yeah. That's not easy. She... It's not easy. No. You turn your your one ankle in a little bit. Well, you're not really supposed to if you're good. Oh, well, I am t- that's one thing I am not. <laughs> <laughs> I, I learned that, uh, but whatever, like, you just you just do you, you know. You, you do whatever makes you slide. Right. Um, it's a lot easier with the rock, though. It really is. And I think it's better when you have real shoes. Oh, you just had the little slip-ons, eh? A little slip-ons, yeah. That's all you get with training. Mm-hmm. That's fair. If you're not going to be a full-time curler guy, then you probably only need the slip-ons. Well, but I think if people had proper equipment, they might be more inclined to, like, stick with it. True. Are you going to join a curling league? Because, I mean, <laughs> no. what, what could it be? Seven, seven weekends a... Uh, a winter? I don't know, but like, I think the broom hands are quite expensive. They're like twenty bucks a pop, and you go through one a game. Sorry. Yeah, if you have like the good ones. Oh. You just you know what you do? You go old school and you bring that straw broom in there. <laughs> can't do it know. anymore. Yeah, you can't I do know. anything <laughs> They're anymore. They're very upset. So do oh, you? Like the do you slappy? You do you must play then, because you seem to know a lot. No, I have played, but I do uh, not play. Oh, okay. I have done what you have done, which is like spend a little bit of time learning the game and playing a couple of times, and then and then you're like, oh yeah, this never game again. Sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's pretty fun. It's pretty fun. It can be pretty fun, but it's also like. It's not super easy, like the weight, like getting the right weight on it. Right. It changes from day to day and like, how's the ice? How dimpled is it? How did they, is it a fast ice or a slow ice? Like, it's like, I don't know, it's hard. I've also discovered too, like, um, it's a unique personality that loves it. Or set oh, okay. of personalities. Um, and also too, it's like, you know, we're going into week five or six. And we still really haven't played a game. So it's like, you haven't discovered the joy of the sport. You're just like learning skills to decide if you like the sport, which is kind of like, you know, if you're gonna learn to play soccer, like let people run around and like play and then give them drills, you know, like, so I think that's what- Yeah, you should have played a game by now. No, no, not good enough. That's the, wow, that's the fun part of any game is the actual playing yeah so you know that's cool you're learning python via how are you liking it so far it's a good language great learning language for sure you can do a lot with that dog knows python do i ever Hates snakes though, so doesn't use it very often. No, go on. Really good at making bad decisions. (laughs) (laughs) You didn't like my song, okay? No, I I thought it was great, but the crowd was thought it was really hilarious. Oh, that's good. Glad someone laughed. Yeah, you? What do you, you got on the go? You doing anything? Much of anything? I set up a bunch of microphones and I'm uh, trying to uh, do a little bit of recording. Oh, nice. So I want to do a little bit of recording this weekend. I also have some uh, house cleaning to do and some, I have to get ready for boring things like taxes and mm-hmm. Did that, you get a, sort of junk. A, a pupper dog or anything? No, and I didn't get out last weekend to go see him. 
Okay. So I might try might try and do that this weekend. We'll have to see how it goes. Uh, he's very young. Oh, okay. Which is, which is oh, okay. Sorry, my mic's too far. People probably can't hear all my good words. Oh, now you're very loud. Oh, I'm sorry. It's also in the shot if you... Does it matter? See what... How's that? That's good. It's great. Love yeah. it. Yeah. Nice. So does this feel like your dude? Yeah. Looks like him, too. Nice. <laughs> Not only does it feel like him, it looks like him. Nice. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna upscale one of these in variation on one of these. Uh... Yeah, do your thing. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, oh someone else did, did it. it. It's Batman. Like legit Batman. So oh, if they you turned it into Batman. If you click on the web, I think it'll pop it out in the web, and you can just like right click and save it. Yep. Oh, balls. Oh. What the heck? It's scary. What is going on? Not good. Uh, okay. Click on it. Yeah. I'm just going to do this. Oh, save images. Okay. And now right click save images. Save images. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Now, did they. They didn't change anything. They just upscaled it, right? I think so. Well, I don't know. Hold on. Let's oh, see what else. People oh, are doing all kinds of. Yeah, they upscaled the two that we liked. Hmm. So not. Maybe we'll just, if we throw them up in Discord, will Lance be able to grab them there? Yeah, absolutely. Cool. Uh, I want to see if anybody's done any of our other ones. Oh, that's a cool one. Mm. Oh, there's some pretty ponies in here and everything. A lot of young Russian boys in the army together <laughs> there's a lot going on in here <laughs> and you can't say nasty come on uh so i want to try a variation on two and three and see what happens. they'll just show up at the bottom right yeah 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 Okay, what are you thinking, Doug? What time is it? Oh. It's about time. Oh, wow. People are doing all kinds of this stuff. Oh, maybe that's you. Two that I just kicked off there. They're not done. Go down, I think. Yeah. This one's done? Yep. What's going on in that upper right one? This is got he's blowing a little bubble out of his ear. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I like the bottom left one again. Mm -hmm. And it fixed the hole in his leg. It did. The hole in his leg. Yeah, they all look better in the legs. I kind of like the bottom right. I like the this eyes, guy. yeah. Yeah, the eyes are cool. The yeah, upper left it, one, the Batman symbol seems to be upside down. It is a, it is upside down. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe that's Batman. how. He's, he's oh. Oh well, then maybe that makes sense, and he can read his own emblem when he looks down. <laughs> oh right, it's me. Oh, I'm. That's. Oh yeah, that's that's the guy I am. <laughs> and the other one's above it, I think. Yeah. These are some pretty mean looking expressions. This feels very superhero y. Like, I like this guy. Aside from the eyes, I like the bottom right. 
Yeah, he's got one crooked eye. Yeah. And the fart cloud behind him, which makes I like sense it. for that breeze. Yeah, I like the fart cloud. Um, no, I like that one like a lot. It. I like that he has like a bandage on one arm. Mm. I like this cape better. Kind of feels like Spawn. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. This one's pretty good. The top top left one. Yeah. Fun. This is high. High. Someone else signed the bottom left one, it looks like. Yeah. Randy. Oh, Randall. <laughs> <laughs> When did the balloon show well, up? Oh, uh, these ones here. Yeah, I don't know. we were talking about about scary balloons, and then the balloons showed up. Popped up. Oh my god! Is is Pennyworth in our? Is he underneath me? Pennyworth. <laughs> he's just worth a penny. <laughs> it's not his name. <laughs> his name's Pennywise, but yeah, oh, he's, totally worth it. He, he's he's but worth a penny. <laughs> yeah. That's what I figured. <laughs> well, uh, I'm just going to do a quick run through all the AI stuff. Oh, my God. Oh, so much. So many nacho chips. Some nacho. Amazing bulldog or French bulldog stuff. This is a uh, uh, French man. Tan, tan France. Uh, pretty slick stuff. This is Shane's France. hunks. <laughs> the the friggin uh best of the bunch hoverboard guys here's some other hoverboards <laughs> i do really <laughs> like this guy. no this but guy it, it's like he wears that suit so he can sweat so he can lose weight yeah he's just he's just over a run <clears throat> oh, amazing i like that that's teacher chong and just george's floating head yes i mean the floating head one is amazing not ours not ours but ours yeah this is super cool yeah um, great work there another variation of one of the earlier ones same these are all we oh it looks like we, we did a variation on every one of these mm -hmm. uh, which is cool and get into the early robotic yeah it's kind of like you'd have to mash these. For me, I would have to mash some of these up to get something I like. To get what you want. Yeah. Which yeah. Is, you know, if you're using this for inspiration, then that sort of makes sense, right? Like, you don't want it to just be perfect. You want to yeah. work with, with it. Yep. As a tool. Oh, it's a tool. Oh, you're a tool. Oh, I mm -hmm. mean, sorry. No, it's fine. That was rude. Yeah, sorry. It's, right. it's accurate. Cool. It's yeah, that was awesome. That was a fun show. Hopefully, that was a great show. That was a lot of fun. You all liked it. It was something different. And, uh, you know, join us next week. It'll be March next week. It will, really? So, Holy shit. Yeah. So happy, um, happy last horrible month and into the new fresh, fresh months. Why do March, you, April. Why May, do you not like, June. what's wrong with February? It was like a very warm February. It's just, it's the last of the dark months. Oh, oh, it's a, it's a light for you. Yeah, I need some light. Gotta get me some sun. That's fair. Yeah, I'm a little pale. I can do some sun. Have a great weekend, everybody, and have a great week, and we'll see you next week. Thanks so much for joining us, and yeah. Take care. Nice work, Doug. Nice work for you, too. Thanks for uh, putting up with all the AI. I love the AI. You're not artificial at all. I love the real people, too. <laughs> okay. Have a great evening, everybody. Night.